voice is a little wonky this morning. This is my 2017 IMATS haul. Fourth IMATS. Can't believe it. Here we go. I'm gonna just pick and grab. I'm not gonna go in any order. I did stop at the Pure booth for Pure. They were having 30 to 40 percent off. This is the JD Weighty Pure Four Piece Royalty Luxe Lip Set, which are four shades here. You can get two liquid lipsticks and two glosses for $29. So I did pick up their Pure Sponge, which was only $8. And they also gave me two of their products in here, um, a cheek stain and a hydrating lip lacquer. I'm not going to have any like inserts of what the colors look like, I'm just going to show them. So these are the four shades that we have. So very sturdy packaging, can't wait to see what their formula is, y'all know I'm a sucker for liquid lipsticks. Also, I, oh I also got, I won this like little contour set that they had there, so this is what this looks like. I did also stop at MAC, they were having 30% off, but I did pick up a Fix Plus, which was only $16 because I needed one. I ran out of my other one. I need to do an empties video, so I need to pick up another one. And then I also got their new liquid lipstick, one of them. This is in the shade High Drama. Probably something like I have in my collection already, but you already know. I'm not even going to say anything. So the Max Fix Plus was $16, and then the liquid lipstick cost $14, so I ended up spending $33 here. Ah, and then this is a huge bag full of stuff. This is the cutest bag that Violet Roth had, I think, personally. Like, it's holographic. You got a freaking unicorn on here. Like, come on. Come on. We need a thumbnail real quick. Everything's reflecting. I'm at 2017. Hi! Everything's full in here, like I packed everything in one bag because for Fame Expo I lost some things, so my good friend Carla was like, girl, you better have everything in one bag, so one bag it is. I had to stop at Namie's because of Galactic, obviously. They were having you buy four items, you get one item free, so I spent 50 bucks here. I got one of their, oh my god broken I'm gonna have to contact them this sucks I didn't drop anything I know I didn't oh man well this is their face glow in the shade bronze which is pretty for my skin tone all right well I have to contact them um, I also got a bronzer from Galactic. It's a little warm, but this is what she looks like. I think it's going to go with my skin tone. This is in the shade Casablanca. Uh, this was a free item that you got when you spent four, four, four items plus. It's basically a shimmering face. This is called Heaven's Dust. This is gold. Um, I don't want to take it out because I don't want to get all messy and get all over me. I did get one of their glitters because Racine was there and her glitter was like popping. I love their glitters. Girl acted. If you don't know, she started with glitters and then she started like, um, and then she started, I can't open this, and then she started growing her brand. She started growing her in, in her, this is it, growing in her products. Like she started making more stuff. So glitter is super, super fine, finer than anything that I own. Um, so anything that I own so I was really intrigued and it looked really nice on her on her lids so I'm really excited to try this because y'all know I'm a sucker for glitter. I did pick up two other liquid lipsticks. I did have three on my list on my list but I ended up getting two because they didn't have one of them that I wanted but they did have the shade called Rustic which is a very beautiful red. I can't wait to try this on. I'm really scared of this color but it's something out of my comfort zone. Oh, I didn't realize that they have castor seed oil in the liquid lipsticks. No wonder it's so hydrating. And it's not like trying. I also got their new blossom shade that just released. These are like one of their two new shades that just released. Uh, as you can see, they're, this one's a little bit more orange. This is a little bit more of a like pink undertones. I did also stop at the lip bar. Little company right here. They were in the third haul. Again, they had two hauls this year. This is what the packaging looks like. It's all white and has lips on it. And this is what she looks like. So 
So it's a very, very nice brown. I actually like this because you're able to see, like, it's different. It's not like your standard one solid color and then clear, you know? So it's kind of like has a design. That's what she looks like. And we went to Tarte Cosmetics. <laughs> it was so embarrassing because we went in because I didn't see that we're, there was a line to get in there. But we just walked. Jojo and I just walked and we're like, oh my god. And then the guy's like, excuse me, there's a line back there. And I was like, oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't notice. Two things from there. I did finally pick up the Shape Tape Concealer that everybody be raving about. Because, you know, I'm on that hype train. So I did pick up the shade Medium. This thing is huge. Like, it looks small in, through the camera when I see videos of other girls. But... It's really big in person and the applicator is really big too. It was only $15 so I saved myself $9 from paying at Sephora with tax. So no tax included here. I also picked up the Tartist Pro Glue Highlight and Contour Palette which is this one right here. This was also $15 so it's half of their like little set thing. Oh, I totally dropped that. I have three shades over here. When I swatched them, they seem super fine. So I'm really excited to try this. The Jouer Booth. Jouer. The Jouer. I got their lip topper called Tan Lines. I was so skeptical about this because it just seems so dark. But Athena, who works there, who I also met at Generation Beauty a year ago, uh, she's like, no, it's going to look good on your skin tone. Like, you're tan. And when, when you get more tan in the summer, it's going to be popping. So this is the Jouer, um, what are you, tan lines, lip topper, and you can use it by itself. It's super pretty. OMG, I'm so excited to use this. We'll see how it works with my other ones. You can top it off on top of any liquid lipstick or even Jouer's. I think it was 13. I don't remember. It was 13 or 15, so sorry about that if I don't know it all of it. So 13 to $15, the Jouer. This was on my list. Because, you know, you just, you just had to go to Lady Moss. I picked up four of their Queen Bee lashes, which is the ones that I'm wearing right now. I got so many compliments on them, and everybody's like, are you wearing Queen Bees? Are you wearing Queen Bees? I was like, yes, I'm wearing Queen Bees. So I picked up four of them. They were four for 20, so I got one stack of them. I picked up my all-time favorite ones, which are the Misha, she Misha Style. Ming. And I picked up a Goddess one and another Queen Bee, so... That was about $40 at Lady Moss. I just stocked up, you know, just stocking up on the lashes because I'm about to pay for shipping. Nah, we cool. I forgot to mention, MAC also gave out a lip pencil in the shade Am To Please because we were waiting in line. So I guess they were like, here you go. I was really surprised they were giving out stuff at MAC because I was not expecting anything from MAC. So this is what it looks like. I swear this year was just lashes for me. Lashes, lashes, lashes. I also stopped at Violet Voss to pick up their foam ink lashes, which are Just Slaying and Unicorn Flare. These are my all-time favorite from this company, especially the style. They were $10 each, and I've worn these in the past before. I constantly wear them. I still have them, but I don't use them as often because I need to, like, I clean them and then reuse them. But I finally have a new pair. I'm really excited. They're super light and they're not heavy whatsoever. It was 20 for the lashes and then they were having a deal. If you buy four glitters, you get a adhesive glitter. I'm not going to take them out, but I will tell you the names. This is Marley. This is Rosalyn, which Carla has and I love it. And I got Sandy and I also picked up, what are you? Champagne Kisses, which the girl recommended. She recommended two of these, and the other two, I, I, I saw them, and I wanted them already. So this was $30 for this bundle, which I think is not bad at all, because you're getting four glitters and the adhesive, and it's like a full size. So I also stopped at Dose of Colors. I ended up saving the bags just because, you know, I just, I just like to save the bags. I picked up Cork for my best friend because she's been wanting this color since forever ago. So I finally picked it up at a discounted price, so that's for her. I did also get me a Supreme Glow Highlighter. I'm going to tell you this was an impulse buy. I swatched it, and I asked, my, I asked Jojo, I said, should I get it? Tell me why this girl behind us was like, just get it. Like, you, you're going to regret it when you go home and be like, I should have got it and think about it. And then you're going to regret it. And I was like, you know what? You're right. I'm getting it. So <laughs> I ended up picking up their Supreme Glow Highlighter. 
which is their new one that just launched back in December, I think. I like the packaging. It's kind of like that NARS packaging for the box. Like, it's, it's really, really pretty. So, this is what she looks like. And there she is. There she is. Very textured, very nice. I'm excited. And then they were also giving out a free gift, which is their pink lip duo. I, I didn't think I was going to get a gift. I, you know what? Everybody I, I met this year was giving free gifts, which is amazing. It's crazy. Like, it's, it's, it's insane. So this is what these shades look like. I know that the, like, big influencers got this in, like, their PR package. So this is really nice of Anna and her team at Doe, so thank you so much. We did stop at the Ardell booth. They were having buy six pair of lashes for 20 bucks, which I thought was amazing. I'm telling you, this is all like, this is more like a lash haul, <laughs> really. I picked up some Demi Wispies. These are standard Demi Wispies. Um, they did come out, they did come out with the, their full mink line, and I got the number 810, which is this one right here. They pick up the double up, um, 202s, which is like a Demi Wispy, but they're doubled, double stacked. Another pair of the double Demi Wispies. Got the 812s full mink style and 811 full mink style. So I thought this was really, really inexpensive. And you know, Ardell's like $3 each, almost four. And, and free gift with purchase. Femme, you got more like lashes individual ones and a duo glue which i needed <laughs> it's like they knew i was coming and like hey let me hook up right with some eyelash glue real quick you know say it's a pretty hefty amount of things but i did have a list it's kind of what i went off by and i did i did pretty okay i did cross out some of the stuff that i didn't want uh, for example sephora collection was there they didn't have their liquid lipsticks unfortunately they only had their brush line and Kat Von D did not have her new liquid lipsticks as well. She did have her concealers, her foundation, and then like the ones that she has right now in her collection. Um, she didn't have the new shades. So I, I really wanted that, but that didn't happen. I'm not too happy about Sugar Pill this year. So the first haul that we went to was the third haul, which was across the main one. And going in, I saw Sugar Pill. That's the first booth that you see right away. I was really, really going to buy the Pumpkin Spice liquid lipstick and the Copper eyeshadow and they didn't have no form of like line people were just going and buying and you know they were just oh what do you need what do you need whatever whatever so i'm like going there i'm swatching the stuff and i'm waiting for someone to come he come and ask me hey what do you need i'm there for like one minute two minutes three minutes four minutes five minutes so i ended up going to the front of the line um and i was like excuse me is are you forming a line or what are you we just grabbing and getting stuff or ordering Tell me why this girl just looks at me and helps the person to my left and is like, excuse me, can I, what can I get for you? I was like, oh, okay, we're going to play that game. Peace out. I was about to spend here. Nah, we cool, we cool. I wanted to buy like two pigments and the duo, the, the duo, like the pumpkin spice and the, the copper, the copper, whatever, that, that new shit that came out, so... I mean, I'm not going to support Sugar Pill anymore. It's unfortunate. They lost a customer or a potential customer, should I say. But that's all I have to say. It was fun. I met Jordan Liberty. He was so, so nice. I met the owner of Galactic as well. She was so nice too. Uh, I wasn't expecting these people that I met today or at IMAT to be so humbling and nice and kind and just talk to you about makeup. So it kind of felt like the first year that I went where I met all these vloggers and stuff, but this time it's like makeup artists and owners of companies. Um, they were just so humbling. And that just shows you like behind who they are and what they stand for. So thank you guys so much for joining me in this haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll catch you in my next video. Toodles.